A very happy and cheerful morning to all my dear students. I hope you all are fine at home and taking care of your health. So we are back with our social studies class. And you remember in the last class we had started the chapter number 2 in civics that is diversity and discrimination. So it's a very interesting topic. It deals with practical life, real life problems. Okay, children. So, in the last class, we had completed the topic that is discrimination. What was it? Means treating people differently on the basis of age, disability, gender, income, etc. Then we studied about prejudice. What is prejudice? When we judge other people negatively without understanding why they are behaving like this or why they are different that is known as prejudice now today we will start with a new topic also an important one that is stereotype so let's go now before starting the topic what is stereotype if I tell you that Agar billi rasta kaategi, if the cat crosses the road, that is a sign of bad luck. Okay, I am sure many of your family members might have told you this sometimes. Right? Or if I tell you that, okay, you are a girl. So, you must be polite always and you may not have interest in cricket. Why? Because I think... Only boys have interest in cricket and girls don't have. Girls like to play with Barbie dolls and boys like to play with all balls and badminton and cricket. So what I did? I made a stereotype statement. Maine kya kiya? Maine ye assume kiya ki girls hain to wo thodi soft nature ki honge. Wo always polite honge and wo zada cricket khelna pasand nahi karenge and boys hain so boys love to play cricket boys don't like to play with barbie dolls or soft toys so what i did i made this stereotype statement maine ye assume kar liya without knowing why because society mein hum yehi sunte aa rahe hain agar koi aisi cheez humne boli because ye humne sunte aa rahe hain society mein so what is it? We are doing stereotype. Now we know that female cricket team is also very famous now in India. So cricket has not been a game only for the boys. It is for the girls also. So what is happening? Things are changing. These are stereotypes. Hain. Girls break karke aur zyada empowered ho rahi hain. Har type ki games khelna starti hain. Wo work bhi karna chahti. If I say that after marriage, girls should not work on the office nahi jana chahi. Why? Because meri family mein to aisa hi hota tha. Meri family mein girls ki shaadi honi ke baad wo nahi kaam pe jati thi. So maine kya kiya? Ye ek stereotype kiya. Kyunki maine ye mera mindset hai because yehi mein sunti aa rahi hu from ages. Yehi mein seekhti aa rahi hu, dekhti aa rahi hu. So, mera bhi mindset yehi ho gaya. Now, if it is right or wrong, that totally depends. First, let's watch the video and then we will discuss. Stereotypes. Prejudice often leads to formation of stereotypes. A stereotype is a bunch of traits that is associated with all members of a specific social group. It influences our behavior and thinking skills. That is, how we assess facts. Girls are friendly, warm, sensitive and emotional, while boys are vicious, tough and dominating. This is an example of a stereotype. The biggest disadvantage of a stereotype is that it tends to know the uniqueness of individuals. It leads to misinterpretation of reality and even causes clashes. When we say that people belonging to a certain country, religion, race or gender are lethargic, crafty or extravagant, we are using stereotypes. On the contrary, people of any community or nation can be generous, poor or lazy. 
सो यू सॉ द एग्जाम्पल वॉर इट सेट दैट अगर मैं ये एज्यूम कर लूँ दैट पर्सन फ्रॉम स्पेसिफिक रिलीजन और कास्ट वॉट वी सी दैट दे आर ऑलवेज एनर्जेटिक दे आर ऑलवेज हेल्पफुल टूवर्ड्स अदर्स दे आर वेरी रिच दे आर शार्प माइंड सो इज दैट नेसेसरी कि उस कास्ट और रिलीजन के हर इंसान ऐसा ही होगा इतना ही टैलेंटेड होगा और इतना ही स्टडीज में अच्छा होगा नो दैट्स नॉट सो दिस इज द डिसएडवांटेज ऑफ स्टीरो हम चीज़ें अज्यूम कर लेते हैं विदाउट नोइंग द फैक्ट्स ऐसा ज़रूरी नहीं दैट इस रिलीजन का इंसान ही हमेशा टैलेंटेड हो फर्स्ट रैंक लाए दे कैन बी पॉसिबिलिटी दैट स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ अदर कास्ट एंड रिलीजन दे ऑल्सो ब्रिंग गुड मार्क्स सो सच काइंड ऑफ स्टीरो टाइप्स आर अ बिग डिसएडवांटेज फॉर द सोसाइटी एंड वॉट एल्स वॉज दैन दैट इट लीज टू मिस रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ रियालिटी एंड इवन कॉजेस क्लैशेस एंड सच काइंड ऑफ स्टीरो टाइप्स दे बिकम डिफिकल्ट फॉर द पीपल टू लिव इन द सोसाइटी Now, as I was giving you the example of cricket, if a girl is talented, she is very good cricketer. But if the family has the same stereotype, कि लड़कियाँ cricket थोड़ी खेलती हैं, you should not go for the cricket selection team. So what will happen? This will be a hindrance for the growth of that girl. ओके okay? ये ये जो क्वालिटी है जो लोगों का माइंडसेट है उसके पेरेंट्स का माइंडसेट है वो एक प्रॉब्लम होगी उस लड़की के करियर के लिए शी कुड हैव बीन अ वेरी गुड क्रिकेटर इफ अ पेरेंट्स वुड हैव अलाउड बट बिकॉज देर पेरेंट्स दे हैव दिस स्टीरो टाइप गर्ल शुड नॉट गो फॉर क्रिकेट एज अ करियर दे शुड नॉट ऑफ दिस एज अ करियर सो दिस इज वाई दिस लिटिल गर्ल दे हैव टू सफर It is not fair to fit a large number of people into a set mold based on certain pre-existing beliefs. We tend to become critical of the situations that are not in agreement with our belief system and stereotypes. Let us take the example of Rama, who is a drug-fear old girl. She does not go to school. She stays at her house to do household works. Rama's brother goes to school because traditionally boys go out and earn money. while girls take care of the household this is an ancient stereotype about the role of men and female members in a family however with the changing time women have started taking up tough tasks outside their homes so this was an example of rano and brother okay rano ka brother ka example tha what was it that rano is a girl who sits at home who does all the household chores and at the same time if we talk about the brother he goes out he goes to school he goes to play with his friends he has been given all kinds of freedom why because only he is a boy is that a good thing to do do you think agar humne rano ko bhi school jana allow kiya hota so maybe rano might be a very intelligent girl maybe she would have got good marks wo apna acha career bhi set kar pati so all such kind of stereotypes are still there but it is mainly in village areas that is some villagers still think that girls should not go out for studying because ultimately they will get married and what's the point of spending money so government has taken steps they have given free education for the girls okay all such kind of facilities are given so that these kind of people should not stop girls from studying also you might have seen that there are some families who feel that girl child nahi honi chahiye baby boy hi hona chahiye because they want boys only they don't want girls so such kind of stereotype negative thoughts is very bad sir we should treat everyone equally be it boys or girls sabko hame equally treat karna chahiye so stereotype is not just related to gender as i gave you the example if the cat crosses our path so it is a sign of bad luck logo ko aisa lagta hai right some people even believe ki agar hamari slipper ya chappal ulti ho jayegi so what will happen there will be fights in our family so such kind of stereotypes are there in the society 
which we all should not believe and we should just be more happy and should allow everyone to study okay special needs shalini goes to school in a wheelchair and joe uses their brains to be both are children with special needs earlier such children were called disabled or handicapped sometimes the word impaired is also used impaired implies loss of a body part or its abnormality Losing an eye in an accident is impairment. It is not necessary that impairment interferes with the performance of the person. Disability is when a person is not able to perform an activity due to some impairment. Handicap is an outcome of the disability or impairment that restricts the person from playing the role as expected from an individual in normal conditions. Today, however, this term has changed and now they are known as children with special needs now now we're discussing about special needs okay so this is an example of shalini shalini is a girl who goes to school on wheelchair okay wo wheelchair pe hai that means she is a person with special needs okay pehle kya bola jata tha first people used to say handicapped or disabled पर हैंडीकैप्ड और डिसेबल इज़ अ नेगेटिव वर्ड राइट किसी को अगर आप बोलो आप डिसेबल हो सो उन्हें वो चीज़ बुरी भी लगेगी वी शुड नॉट से लाइक दिस सो वॉट आर से वॉट आर द वर्ड्स यूज चिल्ड्रेन अ पर्सन विद स्पेशल नीड्स और डिफरेंटली एबल्ड वाई डिफरेंटली एबल्ड बिकॉज अगर कोई उनका बॉडी पार्ट या ऑर्गन वर्क नहीं करता दैट डजन मीन्स दे के नॉट वर्क एट ऑल If I am the boss of a company and if I feel that this person has a problem that he cannot walk, so I will not employ him. But अगर वो work related to legs नहीं है अगर वो sitting job है so I should give this job, isn't it? फिर मुझे उनकी disability या उनकी body part fit नहीं है वो चीज़ नहीं देखनी चाहिए उनकी abilities को हमें उनकी disabilities से compare नहीं करना चाहिए You even saw the basketball thing, right? There were people who were completely physically fine. They were playing, as well as there were people who were playing on the wheelchair. So what this shows that if they don't have something, अगर उनकी body parts totally work नहीं भी करते, that doesn't means that they cannot do anything in life. So हमें उन्हें encourage करना चाहिए. We should give them employment opportunities also. Is that clear? So in this example, Raman uses the Braille script. Now, Braille script is used by those people who are visually impaired. That is, unki eyesight weak ho ya wo blind ho. Okay, unhe use kiya jata hai. So both the children were of special needs. So such people should be called as children or person with special needs and not disabled or handicapped. Is that clear, children? So even if you have any friends who are differently abled or थोड़े disabled हो so हमें वो word use नहीं करना है we should say that they are person with special needs. I think we should stop over here and now let us quickly go towards the worksheet. Let's go. So this is your worksheet. Answer the following in short. What is a stereotype? What is the biggest disadvantage of prejudice? Give example of stereotype in your own words. Explain the meaning of children with special needs. So I hope the topic is clear to all of you. We will meet in the next class. Till that, God bless you all. Goodbye.